Hello, thank you for choosing Apollo Display Technologies. In this video, I will provide a brief overview of our Prisma Eco 3 LCD controller and a quick tutorial on how to correctly connect up your complete kit. Our low-cost Prisma Eco 3 controller has VGA and DVI right on board. It takes a standard 12 volt DC and supports all single and dual channel LVDS panels up to 1280 by 1024. It is important to note when making all connections, ensure the connectors are straight and in the correct orientation for proper insertion. When disconnecting, it is important not to pull on the cable. It's best to use a small flathead or tweezers to pry the connector from the housing. Pulling from the wire can damage crimps or break the wires. Start by finding the LVDS cable and the LVDS input on the rear of the LCD. Identify the end which connects to the LCD, check the tabs on the connector versus the LVDS input housing, ensure it's properly aligned, and make the connection. Take the opposite end, ensure the crimp tabs are facing upwards as shown, and make the connection to CN10, the LVDS output on the Prisma controller. Now find the LED converter cable. Identify the end which connects to the LCD, check the tabs on the connector versus the housing, ensure it's properly aligned, and make the connection. Take the opposite end, ensure the crimp tabs are facing down as shown, and make the connection to CN11, the backlight output on the Prisma controller. Next, you can plug in your video interface. Finally, you can connect your power supply. The Prisma should power on automatically and sync up to the active point. That wraps up the Prisma Eco 3. Thank you for your time and we hope to hear from you soon.